It's time to stop justifying your life by your past. Change your life now. Good morning, my friends. It's I, John, out here on the back deck. And I know you can't see it, but over here to my right, back way in the back, there's actually leaves turning orange back there. Fall is here. We are in the middle of September. It is a beautiful day outside. It's currently 66 degrees, and I'm drinking a beautiful mug of coffee. It's just lovely out here on the deck. This, this video is being prompted by uh, a, an internet troll. <laughs> um, yesterday, I had a guy come on to my comments uh, on my, many of my videos and spammed it with a whole bunch of, you know, why you can't do this and why you can't do that. And I'm justifying my life because of this. And I'm a, I have this condition and it's a, I'm a victim of that. And you know, I I truly empathize with the guy because he he obviously is lost in being a victim. But then, of course, he 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 crossed the line with me and he started saying things about my son. So that's that's one of the quickest ways to get kicked off my channel is to bring my son into anything. Uh, you know, he doesn't know me or um or my son, so he has no clue what he's even talking about. Um. I had another lady yesterday who went, found a video I did on on psychedelics and magic mushrooms and stuff like that. She came on and she was all angry. She said, "Well, you're an, you're addicted to caffeine." She has no idea who I am. She has no idea what I do. She has no idea what I'm talking about. One mug of coffee a day does not an addict make. Number one. Number two. If I was addicted to caffeine, I could never do forty day water fast every year, which I do. So. This person was only on there to justify why they were struggling with their own personal addictions. People will justify and say they can't, and they'll lash out at others to say, to try to justify their positions by saying they, they can't, and, and, that, and by making other people wrong and trying to claim that, that they're right because of blankety blank, 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 whatever it is they're going to say. And I feel, I feel sorry for every one of them because every one of them is just saying, I am going to live my life as a victim. I'm going to live my life because my past experience says life sucks. Now, I have seen amazing people in my life. I've watched people heal themselves. I've watched people change from negative lives to positive lives. I've watched it happen simply by choice. But the choice to say you can't is also a choice. It's, it's you deciding that you are incapable. It's you deciding that you are not powerful. It is you deciding that your life sucks. And when you decide that, what happens is you create that into your experience. Our world is a product of our belief. And when you look at the, the belief of being a victim in life, you will be forever victimized by everything. And the people who choose to be a victim in life the other thing they do is they reach out to others to feel, have people feel sorry for them. Look how terrible my life is. Feel sorry for me. And the second you say, I'm sorry, you're not a victim. And I don't have, I can't bring in your negativity. I, I don't want your negativity. The first thing they do is they go to someone else and they point at you and they say, look what they did to me. You become the next thing that they're a victim of. You can live a joyful life, no matter what you think about your world at this moment. You can change that choice because all, all victimhood is, is habitual thought because of past experience. That's all it is. You know, you look at the, the concepts of how do I want to live a different life? You have to let go of how and just live a different life. One of the readings I did yesterday said, if you want to, uh, live a joy-filled life, then start enjoying life. It really is that simple. I choose to enjoy life. I choose to create a life of possibility. I, I, I choose to create a life where I can create and do anything. You know, and when you're lashing out at people, and, and that's just you choosing to be a victim. That's just you choosing to prove that you're right, that the world sucks. Well, guess what? The world doesn't suck. 
your world might, because you're choosing to believe that. And you can change that right here, right now. Exhale, release the fear associated with being a victim. Come back to the present moment where you are already loved because you're part of God and God is love. There's no part of God that's lesser or greater than any other. And you are deserving of that loving, joyful life. But there's only one person who can actually bring it into your experience. It's you. And when you choose to be a victim, you're choosing to live the, the life experience of somebody else. You're choosing to say that person did this horrible thing to me, or I chose, or this life is just terrible because of blank. That's a choice. And that's your choice. And you can change that right now. Exhale. Decide that the past is done. Decide that today is a blank page and that you're creating something new, that you're, you're living this life in a joyful way, a positive way, a loving way. And if you're lashing out, start to recognize that you're lashing out. You know, if, you're, if, the, the, if the fastest way to prove your point is to attack somebody by attacking someone they love, you're the one with the issue, not, not me or my son. You're the one with the issue. You're the one who's choosing to be a victim of life. And when you choose to be a victim of life, you will experience being a victim of life. Life is beautiful. Life is wonderful. If you choose it. You know, that's one of the things that I talk about on this channel is I'm asking everyone to step, to step into their own personal divinity. Step into the role of creator of their life and, and create the life they want. Create the life they're joyful of receiving. I, I have heard story after story of people who have changed their life just by simply changing their present moment belief. The past is done. It's unchangeable. Let it go. Let it drift away from, from you in the waters of life. You know, coming ahead of you is a whole bunch of new adventures and, and experiences. But you choose the place. You choose the experience. You choose if it's going to be a positive or loving world. Einstein said the most important decision you'll ever make is whether you live in a friendlier or an unfriendly universe. I live in a friendly, loving universe, and I see it every day. And yes, this video is about someone who trolled me and someone who came out to, to prove their victimhood. For every one of you, I get hundreds and hundreds of emails, messages, comments every day thanking me for helping them step into their own power, step into their own divinity, step into their own creation of life to choose more beautiful, loving life, to choose abundance, to choose love. I get for every one of, one of these trolls, I get hundreds, five, 600 a day telling me that. So you're putting, you know, 15, 20 messages on 15, 20, of my videos to just to knock, knock me down doesn't really do much to hurt me all it does is say that i'm not going to allow your negativity to affect the five or six hundred a day who email me i'm just going to block you from the channel so you'll be able to see my videos you'll still be able to get this video and watch this video but you'll never be able to put something on my channel again for somebody else to feel your negativity to feel your justifications as why you can but i hope i'm i i am prayerful that you will see this video and choose to make a different choice because you are the only one who can you're the only one who has the ability to change this present moment experience of yours and you're the only one who can stop reaching out to try to ruin everybody else's day and that's my thought on this you guys have a great day have a loving day have a caring day and for you who who reached out just to prove you're a victim you don't have to be you can choose something different and live it in the now. You guys have a great day. I'll talk to you soon. See ya. Bye.